star in a band like the Stones. I need someone to back me up on vocal. You want to play drums? I've always loved this music. I grew up during this time. And I always felt that I was fortunate to have grown up then because I don't think there's been much better rock and roll produced since. David was a very musical guy. He was a drummer in a band, which people may not know. And I think one of his first loves was to be involved in rock and roll. What were those chords? We really wanted the music to sound good. And so we had an exhaustive casting process and got the best actors for the parts and actually taught them to play the music. He's got to be pretty like rock and roll literate. Yeah, in a month. So what we did is we set aside time for these actors to become musicians. Stephen Van Zandt and a whole core of people worked with them on a daily basis. Keep it the same, Melody. Little Stevie, Stevie Van Zandt, Stephen Van Zandt. He's been there for us all along and has coached us into what we've kind of become. And then, boom, boom, and then, boom, boom, boom. Yeah. He was the perfect guy in so many ways. He didn't sit there hour after hour teaching how to play a guitar. But a lot of the coaching of the acting and the stagecraft of it, Stephen taught them. Learning to play the music for this movie has been really unbelievable, actually. And they have surrounded us by a lot of great people to make sure we knew what we were doing and were able to play these songs. For the past few months, we've taken, what, maybe uh, two years worth of guitar yeah, lessons. Yeah. Jack would come in for three days a week. I would come in for three days a week. Fridays, we'd have the whole band come in and, you know, just jam together and kind of figure out what that is. It's nice that I can't trust you with my secrets. I was so nervous about this, I just couldn't even watch most of it. I came down occasionally, and then, then I started to say, my God, they really, they really took to it very quickly. And I felt a little bit better. And I appreciate the glimpse into your mystery. The main lesson Stevie taught us was to have fun and enjoy it. And I think that's a big part of the movie. You, these guys have a lot of infighting within the band and their families and their lovers and all this and that. I think we should all move to the East Village. There's a music scene there, not here. But the time that they really connect and click is when they're playing their music. No matter what happens off stage, and a lot happens off stage in this movie, once they're on stage, that brotherhood, that family thing, that community thing that a band is, gets communicated. You got talent. Play seven nights a week, two shows a night, call me in six months. Something special happens, or else you're not a band. You know, then you're not for, not for long. And they were a real band for a minute.